Now let's compare the three different hedging strategies we have covered for foreign currency payable. So remember that we purchased antiques from a UK seller and we have to deliver a payment of 150, uh, sorry, 100,000 pounds in one year's time. And our concern is what it's going to cost us in terms of dollars, since we do not know what the future spot rate is going to be in one year's time. So the cost with forward hedge is guaranteed $150,000 regardless of future exchange rate. The cost with money market hedge is $143,888, again, regardless of future exchange rate. With options hedge, at most, it's going to cost us $160,500, but it could be less depending on future spot rate. So we may choose not to exercise our call options and instead just go directly to the spot market and buy pounds if future spot rate happens to be less than $1.50 in the future. So just by comparing these three different numbers, we can see that we, uh, that we can immediately eliminate forward hedge from consideration. Because remember that these dollar amounts are costs, and we obviously want to minimize cost. So forward hedge cost is greater than money market hedge. Uh, so we can say that money market hedge is superior to forward hedge since it gives us lower guaranteed dollar cost. So we can cross out forward hedge from consideration. So next we are trying to compare money market hedge against options hedge. So we can compute the break even exchange rate between these two options, uh, between these two hedging strategies by setting the dollar cost from money market hedge equal to dollar cost from options hedge. And then when we solve for that, we get the future uh, spot rate of dollar a 33.39 cents as our break-even exchange rate. So what this means is if in the future, if you think that spot rate is going to be greater than this number, uh, you would prefer money market hedge because the cost will be less than the options hedge. But if in the future spot rate is going to be exactly this number, uh, options hedge and money market hedge will both cost you $143,888, so you are really indifferent between these two hedging strategies. But if in the future spot rate is expected to be lower than dollar uh, 33.39 cents per pound, then options hedge is preferable because it will generate lower total dollar cost in the money market hedge. So which option you prefer between money market hedge and options hedge really depends on your expectation of future exchange rate. But forward hedge is something we can definitely can uh, eliminate because this was inferior to the money market hedge.